This tutorial will describe a simple technique in Adobe Illustrator using an obscure function in the Rotate tool to create radial patterns. Note that I have Smart Guides enabled. We'll use the snapping function of the Smart Guides to create an accurate center point around which the radial pattern will be created. Here I use the Ellipse tool to create that center point. It could be any shape, it doesn't really matter because this box would likely be deleted anyway after the radial pattern is created. In this example, I again use the ellipse tool to make a simple shape out of which the radial pattern will be made. Since I want to focus on the function in the rotate tool, I won't really get into making a fancy radial gradient and more interesting radial patterns and just stick with the function of the tool. With your object selected, press R to enable the rotate tool and the crosshairs will appear in the center of the object. The only trick is to click and hold the ALT button on your keyboard as you left click with your mouse on the crosshairs before dragging the rotate point to the center point of your radial. As you release your mouse button, the rotate dialog box will appear. I'll enter the angle as 360 degrees divided by 12, but of course you can enter any number of divisions that suit your needs. I forgot, one more trick. Instead of pressing OK, we want to press copy to exit the dialog box. As you see, this performs the function of rotating a copy of your shape around the radial point that you've defined by 360 degrees divided by 12, or 30 degrees. Next, we'll hold down the control key and press D to duplicate the function as many times as necessary. Here's an example showing something you can do using this technique to create a nice background with radials and gradients.